Cornwall Free Wheelers is a charity run by a group of advanced motorcycle riders. Its purpose is to relieve sickness and protect patient health by the transport of urgently needed blood, drugs, human tissues and other medical requirements between National Health Service hospitals and other medical facilities. This service is provided outside the normal operating hours of the regular transport services and, because it's completely free to the NHS, it allows massive savings to hospitals who would otherwise either incur contractor courier fees or taxi fares or be forced to divert frontline ambulance crews and even air ambulances. Please support us when you can. Well, we operate mostly out of hours, so that means it could be in the evening, early in the morning, it could be at a bank holiday or a weekend, Saturday or Sunday. Uh, the NHS cover the office hour times with their own system, so really we would typically get a call like 8, 9 o'clock in the evening. Okay, I'll give you a call when I'm done. Cheers. Uh, well, the phone will ring and it will be the coordinator from Cornwall Freewheelers and he'll ask whether or not the rider is available to take the run. Um, bear in mind that we, we don't always use the blood bike, we sometimes use our own bikes. Um, if you've had a drink in the evening, you have to say no because we can't go out after having consumed alcohol. We might have another appointment. But anyway, he'll ask you whether you're uh, available to do the run. If the answer is yes, then we have a form that we have to fill in, which notes where we're picking up from, uh, what the actual goods are, who the contact of that hospital or institution is, uh, where we're taking the goods to, which uh, ward in the hospital we're taking it to, who the supervisor is of the ward. Um, then we uh, get kitted up and, get, and go out and collect the, collect the goods. Um, there's a three part form which uh, every, is given to each of the um, people involved in it, so the three wheelers keep one copy, one is given to the hospital where we pick up, and one is given to the hospital where we deliver. So there's a paper trail of, of who was uh, dealing with that particular delivery. Um, once we've delivered the goods, we give the coordinator a phone call to let him know that we've uh, delivered the goods. And then as an extra safety aspect, once we get home, we give him another call just to let him know that we're home safely and that we haven't had any problems on the
No, so I think you were expecting this. Yeah. Yeah, if you don't mind. Oh, I think actually has a, a, a community spirit about it. People feel they are involved in helping. Because they'll often stop and ask us questions. Why do you do it? What do you do? How do you do it? And, you know, we'll chuck 50p in the, in the bucket or the collecting tin. So there's a, it's, it's more than just saving money for the National Health Service. It's being able to contribute. And also, it enables others to help out as well. It gives them a, an avenue to help support the National Health Service.